Open the door, please. In Flint, Michigan, a house equipped with two ring cameras witnessed a frightening event one night. At around 10 p.m., a man in a red jacket and another person approached the front door. The man in the jacket attempted to break it down but failed. Undeterred, he moved to the side door trying to force his way in. The homeowner awakened in panic, checked the cameras and saw the intruders. Speaking through the camera, the homeowner scared them off. The police were called, and upon reviewing the footage, they found one of the men armed. Their intentions remain unknown, as they were never identified. In this recorded video from the doorbell camera, a person without a shirt is visible attempting to open the door. He tries to remove the window frame or something similar, but it appears that he gives up on his attempt and abandons his mission. In this eerie video, a woman struggles to unlock her door while arriving home at night. She seems frightened by a nearby car. Thankfully, she makes it inside without more trouble. The video raises suspicions that the car was following her as it slowly turns around. Towards the end, an unexplained honk is heard, possibly indicating that the woman scared away the stalker by sounding her horn from inside. The unsettling driving of the person suggests a potentially sinister situation. In this chilling video, a doorbell camera captures a man, an ex-boyfriend, attempting dark revenge on his former girlfriend. As she answers the door, everything appears friendly, but he tries to hide the camera's view suspiciously. Naively, she invites him into her home. Hey. Hey, what's up? How are you? Good, how are you? What's going on? Nothing, just thought that other neighbor, I thought I'd stop by, so I... Right. Yeah. Come in. Come in. Um, I just got out of the hospital. I must die. The video cuts, and when the audio resumes, the woman reveals she was struck by a bottle and doused in alcohol. Shockingly, he confesses he wanted to set her ablaze, but fortunately, it didn't escalate to that extreme. Get out of my house! Get out of my house! I will! And you're gonna light me on fire because yeah. you just blew alcohol all over me? Yeah. We'll take it to now it's not over because now I'm calling the cops. This serves as a scary reminder that evil can hide within those we once trusted dearly. The doorbell camera captures an individual wandering around the front yard, near the swimming pool. Later he approached the house, but the video abruptly ends, leaving us uncertain about the events that followed. The footage shows a person carrying a backpack and holding a flashlight, attempting to pry into the house. He is clearly snooping around, trying to gain entry. However, after a brief moment, the individual makes the decision to abandon his plan. Yeah, hey, I'm gonna call the police, what you want? Hey. I, I see your face. 
Yo, I see you. He hop on his bicycle and ride away from the scene, perhaps realizing that he has been caught on the doorbell camera or encountering some obstacle that deterred him from proceeding further. Outside the door, two individuals engage in a heated argument with the lady homeowner. Hey, your daughter got my car. So your daughter bring her my car, man. Come on. Hello, can I help you? Hey, yeah, uh, your, your daughter, uh, uh, they got, uh, my homeboy's car. She got my homeboy's car. It's my car. I need my car back. Uh, you're... You're trying to come here and get my back. Uh, my daughter, um, I think you're at the wrong address. Look, they already told me that she has my car. Just tell her to come here, give us our car, and everything will be alright. I'm sorry that that's her boyfriend. He went to jail. She got all Regrettably, the footage abruptly ends, leaving us in the dark about the events that follow. Once the man regains his composure, he quickly takes down the smart doorbell from the wall. The reason behind his actions remains uncertain. Some speculate that he might have wanted to remove the surveillance to potentially burglarize the home later, or to get rid of evidence. However, it's worth mentioning that other cameras were present, making his attempts futile. On a dark night in Rochester, New York, the eerie footage begins. At around midnight, a man approaches a home and rings the doorbell. Moments later, he hides anxiously behind a parked car, clutching a mysterious club-like object. His heavy breathing and profuse sweating betray his nervousness. Furtively, he scans the street and then back at the front door. The man appears to be under the influence of something. Realizing that no one is answering the door, he walks away. But just as he leaves, a voice warns that the police are on their way. The source of the voice remains unclear. Two possibilities arise from this peculiar scene. First, perhaps the man was hiding from someone and sought refuge inside the house to evade detection with the voice belonging to the person he was trying to avoid. Second, he might have planned something sinister, attempting to lure the homeowner into opening the door. Regardless of his intentions, one thing is certain. The man did not have good intentions, and his actions that night were suspicious and concerning. In the doorbell footage, the individual behaves oddly. Firstly, they place an object obstructing the view of the doorbell camera. Subsequently, they grab a package, or some unidentified item, and leave the scene. such actions appear perilous and raise concerns. In this video, the person attempts to enter the house with an air of familiarity, as if it were their own home. However, they abruptly depart without any apparent reason for their actions. The motive behind their behavior remains unknown. Dogs make wonderful companions. In the front yard of a house, a person climbs in. Suddenly, the vigilant dog begins to bark loudly and chases after the intruder. Frightened by the dog's response, the person hastily climbs back out of the yard.
Fortunately, this entire incident is captured by the doorbell camera. In the dead of night on April 9th, 2023 in Albuquerque, New Mexico, a homeowner peacefully slumbered. Unbeknownst to him, a peculiar event unfolded while he slept. Later, upon waking and checking his phone, he was horrified by a notification revealing a strange incident captured on his surveillance camera. The footage displayed a woman persistently attempting various keys to enter the house, even searching for a hidden one. Bafflingly, she tried the doorbell camera too. The woman's erratic behavior escalated, hurling rocks at the homeowner's car and struggling with the locks. The homeowner claimed he didn't recognize the woman, who eventually departed mysteriously, leaving her intentions shrouded in uncertainty. In the footage from the doorbell camera, we can observe an individual skulking around the premises. Suddenly, the alarm of the parked pickup truck blares loudly, startling the person, who becomes visibly frightened and quickly scurries away from the scene. The video captured by the doorbell camera reveals a sequence of events. Initially, an individual is seen behaving suspiciously around a car parked in front of the house, appearing to snoop around it. Eventually, the person discovers that the car is unlocked, prompting them to enter it. However, at this point, the video abruptly cuts off, leaving us uncertain about the subsequent occurrences. On the YouTube channel Nelly Security, an investigator captures a fascinating incident. A potential thief spots a security camera directly aimed at him. Realizing he's being recorded, a transformation occurs within him. He seems to have a change of heart, abandoning his nefarious plan. Evidently, the mere sight of the camera dissuaded him from committing the theft. The individual standing outside the house becomes visible on the doorbell camera. His behavior appears rather peculiar as he knocks on the door and talks to himself. It becomes evident that he is attempting to gain entry into the house. Yeah. Yeah. Baby, running in. I'm gonna tell them right neighbors tonight. See what they on. See what they on. We gonna see what they doing. Eventually, he settles on the porch stairs, seemingly affected by some substance.
six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's what them real niggas trying to get with. Ring footage reveals masked men wearing hoodies, forcing entry into a house. Suddenly the video ends, leaving no clue about stolen items or arrests. Let's hope they are caught soon, if not already. Late at night, security footage captures a man dressed as Michael Myers, standing menacingly outside a house. Maybe he has cruel intentions or just playing a prank, but the homeowner doesn't find it funny. The eerie scene unfolds. Suddenly the man lunges at the camera, startling the homeowner. She questions his actions. He continues staring, trying to intimidate her before eventually leaving without a word. Who knows what he had in mind? The incident leaves the homeowner uneasy, wondering about the stranger's intentions. The chilling encounter remains a mystery, leaving everyone on edge. In Kentucky, a peculiar scene unfolds as a man arrives at an unfamiliar place seeking a job. He assures he has nothing harmful on him. Leaving a cryptic message, he walks away hoping to find someone he knows. Seeking help after being released from jail, he pleads for love. The response of Hill Manor remains unseen, but surely they're unnerved. One should never open doors to strangers, for we can never be sure of their intentions. The video captures a strange encounter, leaving us wondering what lies beneath the surface. In this video captured by a doorbell camera, an individual carrying a flashlight is seen behaving suspiciously. Their intentions become clear as they inspect the parked cars outside, apparently looking for items to steal. The person proceeds to examine two cars, presumably searching for valuable belongings to pilfer. It's evident that their actions are not innocent, and they seem to be on the lookout for opportunities to commit theft. The doorbell camera successfully captures this illicit activity, raising concerns about the security of the neighborhood and the need to remain vigilant against such potential threats. In this story, a doorbell captures footage of a visitor acting strangely. The woman seems to move in a confusing manner, but it might be because the video is fast. Maybe she dropped something in the grass and is searching for it. She's barefoot, indicating she might be a neighbor or familiar with the place, Without more details, it's tough to know if she's a stranger to the homeowner. Hence, the footage gives an eerie feeling, leaving us wondering about the whole situation. An individual enters the front yard of a residence and proceeds to enter a car parked in the driveway. Inside the vehicle, they engage in theft, taking valuable belongings or possessions from within the car. In Indiana, a young man appears in a stranger's backyard holding a weapon. When he spots a camera, he quickly dons his helmet and rides off on his motorcycle, leaving the startled homeowner uneasy.
It's unclear what his intentions were, but they couldn't have been good. Once upon a time in Texas, a homeowner experienced an unusual and somewhat frightening incident. Late at night, around 1.20 a.m., there was a knock at the door for a DoorDash delivery. However, the homeowner hadn't ordered anything as she was fast asleep. It was only her and her nephew at home. The next morning, the homeowner noticed damage outside her house and recalled hearing a strange clinking sound during the night. Intrigued, she checked her doorbell and backyard cameras. The footage revealed an unexpected situation. Firstly, a woman claiming to be from DoorDash appeared at the door from 1.20 a.m. to 2 a.m., possibly having the wrong address. Not too concerning, right? However, it was the backyard footage that was truly alarming. At 2 a.m., four men tried to sneak into the house through a window. It seemed they planned to ambush whoever answered the front door for the fake DoorDash delivery. Luckily, no one answered, and the intruders failed in their attempt. They fled together in a dark-colored car, never to be caught by the police. The homeowner remained safe, but the incident left her feeling uneasy. This individual is loitering outside a residence with questionable intentions. Upon spotting a car approaching, the person becomes wary and conceals themselves behind a nearby wall, presumably to avoid being noticed. After the vehicle passes, the individual departs abruptly, attempting to give the impression that their presence there was inconsequential and nothing out of the ordinary occurred. This video caught people's attention. The comments section is filled with mixed opinions. Some believe it's just someone's kid, but a user named Emily clarifies that they have no children and their yard is securely fenced. This leaves everyone puzzled. Could it truly be a genuine ghost sighting on the Ring doorbell camera? Let's see for ourselves. In this footage captured by a doorbell camera, a woman can be observed attempting to open the door. She manages to successfully open the outer door, but for some reason, she decides to abandon her mission and does not proceed any further. According to the doorbell camera footage, a person can be observed with his shirt hanging over his shoulder. This individual is shown ringing the doorbell and engaging in conversation with it, as if addressing the doorbell itself. Additionally, the person's behavior appears to indicate that they might be under the influence of some substance, as their actions and speech seem erratic or unusual. In the backyard of the houses, there is visible evidence of a person removing a parked car that belongs to someone else. The individual is observed taking the car away without permission, indicating an unauthorized and potentially illegal action. In this video, a woman named Alicia Marufo from Sacramento records a strange encounter. The woman claims to be an investigator from the California State Board of Equalization, suggesting a connection to taxes. She threatens to involve the police if Alicia is not the lease tenant, demanding her removal. 
Uh, who are you? Investigator from the California State Board of Equalization. Looking for the owner of the property. I'm pretty sure if you're the tax fraud investigator for the state of California, that you'll know how to find a property. If you're not the tenant on a lease, then I'm gonna have the police out here and have you removed in two days. You understand? <laughs> Well, this house looks like it's got issues, you okay? Like and there's pro no, okay. Oh, some in your door. You got squatters here at this property, and I'm gonna prove to the police that you don't own it, okay? You're a squatter. Alicia remains unsure of the woman's intentions. As the situation seems to end, the woman returns, threatening to take action against Alicia's son's construction work. What makes it more puzzling is the woman's mention of her official role in relation to spider webs on the lawn. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm gonna have you removed from this property in two seconds and I've got your phone number out here and your son's card. And I'm gonna make sure that he's doing no construction without a spider webs in your car, in your... It remains unclear whether she's truly an investigator or pretending to be one. A person is observed peering into the house by looking through one of its windows. Upon discovering the presence of a doorbell camera, the individual promptly decides to leave the area, making a swift departure. In April 2023, in a wooded part of Asheville, North Carolina, a homeowner receives a notification of motion detected at her front door. On opening her phone app, she spots three bears on her porch, ripping open a delivered package containing dog food. The bears must have caught its scent. She bravely steps out and confronts the animals, attempting to scare them away. Go! Regrettably, the bears manage to snatch one bag of dog food before nonchalantly walking off into the distance. In the video recorded by the doorbell camera, there are two children visible. One of them presses the doorbell, and upon hearing the automated message of the doorbell, he seizes a scooter nearby and swiftly makes off with it. We can't answer the door right now. But if you'd like to leave a message, you can do it now. The second child remains at the scene in a rather enigmatic manner and also rings the doorbell. However, the outcome of their actions beyond this point is uncertain, as it is unclear what transpired afterward. In a troubling story shared by Caitlin D. Curtis, she recalls an unsettling meeting with a person at a park. Three days later, the same individual appears at her doorstep at 3 a.m., causing distress. As she waits, he brushes his teeth with his finger, showing odd behavior. With no response, he acts strangely in a rather bizarre video. A woman is standing in the lobby outside the apartment doors. Her actions suggest that she is attempting to gain entry into one of the apartments as she goes from door to door, trying each one in her quest to find a way inside.
an individual passes by and approaches the mailbox. After opening it, they retrieve an item from inside. Subsequently, the person departs from the area. You are currently being recorded. All of these actions are captured and recorded by the doorbell camera. In Staten Island, New York, a man receives an alert from his son's ring camera. A stranger attempts to open the door and heads towards the backyard. Worried, the homeowner calls the police and rushes home. He finds the intruder using his bag to gather belongings. Immediately I call, I call 911. I tell them, hey, I believe somebody's trying to break into my home. Yeah, I had told the police on the, uh, the, when I called 911 that I was going to engage with him. Uh, I saw him standing in my backyard using my bag to put my belongings in it. Yeah, it was crazy. After a brief scuffle, the burglar escapes, but the determined homeowner chases him for several blocks and reports him to the police. I snuck up behind him, we got into a little scuffle. I was following him for about two blocks. I've had like my car broken into before. Uh, it's just like... Uh, you just sped up. Yeah, it's just, it's, it's just uh, an invasion. You know, it just feels like somebody's violating, you know, your property. Standing up against the invasion, the homeowner's bravery ensures the intruder is brought to justice. Taking matters into his own hands, he protects his property and sends a strong message to potential wrongdoers. The doorbell footage captures the presence of a female individual who stands outside the door. Hi. If you'd like to leave a message, you can do it now. Hello? Yo, leave that there. You're on camera, dog. Hey. It appears that she waits for a moment before possibly taking hold of the package and leaving the area in a seemingly effortless manner. In this video, a shirtless man walks around outside an apartment, talking to himself. There's no one else around, but his behavior seems confrontational and intimidating. He goes downstairs and continues this strange confrontation near a restaurant. It's unclear what's happening, but it's better to avoid the hallway and not engage with the individual. Their actions appear unpredictable and could be disruptive. While most videos are funny, some can be disturbing like this one. In the footage captured by the doorbell camera, a male individual is visible. He is attired in a hoodie and seen smoking a cigarette. Initially, he presses the doorbell. Subsequently, he moves around the area near the door and eventually takes a seat on the porch. After a period of time, he is observed picking up a lawnmower and proceeding to leave with it. In the recorded footage, a woman is clearly visible. She approaches the location, then promptly takes hold of the food storage box before leaving in a swift manner. This footage is from a doorbell camera and clearly shows an individual standing outside a house. Subsequently, the person proceeds to enter the house, successfully gaining unauthorized access without much difficulty. In the dead of night, 
a chilling doorbell footage captures a peculiar girl approaching their house. She utters unintelligible whispers, repeating them in an eerie manner. She tries the doorbell, making her intentions clear. Then she attempts to open the garage, leaving lingering concerns about her motives. Although not aggressive, it raises questions about her true intentions. It's crucial to be cautious when offering help, as situations like this might be deceptive schemes. Be mindful of potential risks. Now, if you fear dogs, avert your eyes. In Kansas City, a man sneaks onto a woman's property, avoiding the camera's view. He tries to snatch the ring camera but fails. Unbeknownst to him, the woman and her son are inside the house. The intruder, the woman's ex-boyfriend, returns later with a cloth to conceal the camera. A man tries to enter this house that doesn't belong to him. A woman's voice from the doorbell speaker startles him, freezing him in place. However, after a moment, he decides to walk away. The reason remains a mystery. Perhaps he got the wrong address, or maybe he harbored some sinister intentions. Luckily, we'll never find out the truth behind his actions. And so, the curious incident of the unfamiliar helm remains an enigma, leaving everyone grateful that no harm was done. There was a couple who had just returned home. Suddenly, they noticed an unwelcome guest inside their house, a vulture. Worried about their beloved dog, Georgia, they sprang into action. Without knowing how the vulture got in, their focus was on protecting Georgia. Whoa! Okay. What? Vulture in the house. A what? A vulture. A liar. Swear to God. A liar. What are you talking about? Touch Where's Georgia? Is she okay? Yeah. Where is she? Georgia. 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 Come here. Come on. Come on. What vulture? In a moment of panic, the wife grabbed the nearest thing she could find, an umbrella. She bravely confronted the vulture and managed to chase it outside with the umbrella's surprising effectiveness. I hear something. Oh, my God. I'm Where is it? Do you see it? Yes. It's in the it? living room. I'm going to get it. I needed to make myself bigger than this vulture. I was running around this house with the umbrella, flapping it open and closed. I mean, it was the craziest thing. Yeah. Despite the mystery, the couple in Georgia were relieved that nobody was hurt. They couldn't help but be thankful for their quick thinking and the umbrella that unexpectedly came to their rescue. In this unsettling footage, a homeowner's worst nightmare unfolds as a man appears outside their door in the middle of the night, asking invasive and creepy questions. The conversation intensifies, leaving viewers uneasy about the stranger's true intentions. The homeowner insists it's the wrong house, but the man persists with unsettling remarks. The homeowner warns him about her armed husband. Steven here. You got the wrong house. <laughs> I knew this was a ripoff. Okay, what, are you looking for a Steven? No, I am Steven. I'm looking for uh, Fifi. Yeah, you got the wrong house. So, you don't want to have sex tonight? Uh, sir, my husband in the living room with the. Huh. Okay. Have a good Understood. night. Eventually, the man leaves, but the woman is left traumatized by the encounter. The video raises questions about the stranger's motives and serves as a chilling reminder of the importance of safety and security in our homes. In Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, a man appears on a ring security camera. He's fleeing on a stolen motorcycle pursued by the police. As the chase unfolds, adrenaline rushes through his veins. 
he bravely leaps off the bike, hoping to shake off the authorities. Determined to escape, he scales over a fence, desperation in his eyes. The sirens wail in the background, echoing the urgency of the moment. Will he outrun the long arm of the law? The suspense builds as the man's fate hangs in the balance. The race for freedom reaches a gripping climax. The ring camera has recorded footage of a determined woman attempting to enter a residence. She appears to be engaged in a heated argument with the homeowner, utilizing the doorbell microphone for communication. Hello? Hello? Please open the door, it's Sabrina. This is my house, open the door, please. What's Sabrina? Sabrina, you at my house. If you don't leave my door, I'm gonna call the police. Call the police, I need you to. Why are you saying this is your house? Open the door, please. The woman's persistence in gaining entry to the home is evident from the captured video and her animated exchange with the homeowner indicates the seriousness of the situation. In Los Angeles, California, a man is caught on ring camera during the day trying to break into a house. He's climbing over the fence, attempting to gain entry again. Hey, what are you doing? Hold on to our final clip, which is the most scariest and creepiest one. And if you like what you saw, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on our creepiest videos. In Anchorage, Alaska, a thief braves the freezing cold to steal from a car. The car owner catches her in the act. Another person tries to use a moose as an excuse but the car owner remains firm. The moose stands nearby, not a threat. Excuse me, the f are you doing in my car? There's a moose right there, look. Come. I, I don't need to fucking come and see I'm a moose. I'm scared. Can, can you do it? No. No, a moose. I, I don't care, a moose ain't gonna do shit. They're gonna attack me. No, they're not. The person persists, seeking help from the car owner, but he advises to ignore the moose and walk away. The person apologizes, but the car owner insists on leaving the area. Can, can you help me? Help you what? With the moose? Dude, you ignore the moose and the moose ignores you. There's a calf and a mama. And I, don't, I just don't, I'm scared to. I know how, how moose are, they attack. So I, I'm like right there. I, My apologies. Please go away. No, I can't go away. You're trespassing. I'm not. Uh, go around the block, walk away from the moose. Yeah, just don't go near them and you'll be fine. Please get off of my. Trespassing won't be tolerated. With a reminder to avoid the moose, the car owner protects both the thief and himself from danger. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can stay updated with our latest videos.